Hi everyone. In this video, we're gonna start a new section in Autodesk Robot Structure Analysis, in which we're gonna analyze, find reactions of different structures using this software. Finally, we're gonna compare the results with those found in the textbook. So let's start with this exercise. The first step, just check whether the units are correct or not. Go to Tools, Units and Formats, Metric, OK. Next step is Modeling. First, click on this icon, add the first point, second point at 12, go to Z, add the first point, then apply. OK, now click on the bar icon and click on the first point and the last point. Now we assign support. Okay, we check what type of support is here. As it's shown here, it's fixed. So we go to supports, fixed, and apply it to this point. Then close it. After that, we assign loads. To assign loads, First, we add load types, did load 1, this type of load um, is used to account for self-weight, we add did load 2, then close it. After that, go to load definition, bar, and this one. As it's shown here, this one is approximately the same as the one we want to add. So, its values are here, I have added them previously minus 15 and minus 5 okay and it starts from the beginning at ends at the last point of the bar so we add it and close to turn on the uh, to see whether the loads have been added or not we we'll check from here Okay. Once loads have been added, they can be revised from here. Go to loads, load table. As you see here, we have did load two as tra uh, trapezoidal one, uh, one and uh, did load one the self weight. Okay. Now start the analysis. Okay. Now to check the results, go to results reactions. As you see here, as a result of case 1, which is dead load 1, we have these results, FZ and MY. And as a result of case 2, which is dead load 2, we have 120 and we have 600. Okay, to see ju just the results we have added, go to dead load 2. To show the results on this diagram, we go to results diagram of bars, reactions, FZ and MY. Okay, then apply. As you see here, we have FZ 120 and MY 600. The final step is comparing these results with the calculated ones in your textbook. So we go to the textbook As you see here, we have the moments as 600 and FZ is 120. Okay, so this is the end of this first exercise. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, just do not hesitate and write it in the description below or send it to my email. Bye.